Hi viewers and Annie for this Tarot Together. Um, I watched your video about cleaning and feeding your cards. I have to admit that it's something I have never really think of because I have mm, nearly never had problems with my cards uh, from as you say, shuffling them, like the glue or things like that. Um, the, I, I love to put them on my altar. I, I feel that energetically it keeps them safe. So I have my water cards there, my air cards, my Owasoma tarot and my dragon tarot there. The cards I take for the day, they are the one from Guillaume, so the tarot, the water card, one card that just um, pop up the, the box so it's for us, and my cards. Um, when I receive a deck, I'm just the kind of little looking at it shuffling it and just begin to work with them. I don't uh, make some ritual to have a relation. For me the relation will come little by little with the cards and yeah when I work like this on the everyday card it's my better way to make a relation with them because every day I take a card, I see the day I will have uh, with this card and the message that is behind, behind the card uh, more than what is written on the book. Sometimes I just read what is written on the book uh, in the evening so I can have um, an idea of what is it, it is about for my day, it has been about. Um, I use also cards for my rituals like this. Um, so yeah, I just my relations come little by little, and when I don't use my cards, most of the time, see, for example, my rest of my cards were just in there because I am. Um, not really more space in this box. This is the magic box my father did for me. You have some of my magic books and yeah, just some cards there. So I, if there's a tower I really find precious, it will it will go there and. I have sorry for moving with me. I have another place. I store some cards there, there, there. It's like my magic bibliotheque, <laughs> magic library for me with my music for meditation and my cards. The things that I would maybe want very fast because the the big library is up there and I have to move up and down so I keep the necessary there. And what could I say? Um, when I work with cards, I sometimes love to link them with stones like there or there. Sometimes I put a stone on it, I put a stone on the box. For me it's a way to feed the cards, give them the energy and also give to the car, to the stone the energy of the card. It's a relationship. And if I had really to clean um, the tower, I would Surely use some purifying stone on the deck for a moment. Uh, I had problems with uh, some hyper negative 
persons at one moment in my life and they, uh, they were quite the person if they touch one your deck um, <laughs> their age energy is really really not yeah it's imprinting everything and it's quite not your deck anymore um, so I would say that since I met them um, I just take my mm, take my cards apart, they are just my cards I share them with my husband for our everyday card and he shares also his card uh, when he has but we just discussed it like yesterday and my first tarot deck and his first tarot deck are like um, sacred uh, I can't, I don't have the right to touch it, it, don't, it doesn't have the right to touch it, um, it's a precious first deck, uh, the one we are linked the most, yeah, so I don't clean them specially, um, but if I clean my altar, they are just with smoke for example, they are in the cleaning, and keeping them on my altar for me is keeping them on a sacred, a secure, secured place for them. They are grounding, they are charging, they are in the good place. And if I want to give them an extra energy, I would put them on my pentacle <laughs> like this. And like this, I have this fluorite and it's a great crystal cleansing stone it uh, gives back the um, natural state on you it's just who we are outside of the external influence it for the guards it will be the same i try to work on this elixir because my body doesn't uh, tolerate it so maybe with um, some good energy, it will be more good for my body. So, um, thank you for watching, see you later, and thank you, Annie, for all these beautiful videos. I love you.